5-0 uh, last time from Banya on the last go around uh, still are seeing some of the team managers didn't get let back in the likes of uh, Christophe Bergignon we've got Quattararo and Vignales and they're about well they're over half a second three even and he learned how to manage a race remember him losing out to Frankie Borbidelli as we look on the inside for Fabio Quattararo and Jack Miller's going to see him coming through but while Top Honda on the grid and the Japanese rider beautiful looking bike but not when it's in bits and on the Ducatis but in terms of lap times Pekka Vijaya's just in a personal best but it's still a lucky ride isn't he there in 8th place on the second of the Pramac bikes his teammate are just having a little bit of a look again uh, that they wouldn't rattle each other they watched out there but shoulder injury beset his whole year it was almost a one 12 and a half laps into it oh, sorry we to Suzuki Maverick Vinales is attacking Quattararo and Vinales also on the move up into third didn't have it he hasn't got it this weekend but the fact he's gone back in front of Quattararo suggests to me they look fine to be yeah. honest don't they here we're we go. go Maverick into the left hander bit of a wobble on from Maverick so he's about, about point four of a second faster than oh another group. under down Alex Marquez has gone down I don't know what's happened to Valentino Rossi I've just seen he's down to 15 15 just two yeah, spots yes. ahead I, from a Yamaha from another Ducati here comes Maverick Vinales he's going to take the lead from Peko Bagnaia he's been lurking for a number Tradmir the world champions up into fifth place past Fabio Quattraro this is like a race from last year for Felix Rins is going to want to come through last time I want to see the lap time he did a 55-7 Bagnaia was down in Hello. that cost Jack quite a bit of time and that's definitely held to lay shouts yeah, it's hard. Well, if he can get, probably if he can half that gap, he's a chance of being able to level him by the end of the straight. But unfortunately, it's not bearing fruit in the race. Zarko's done really once. The KTM's have been having a nightmare. This track doesn't suit their motorcycle they, at all. They hate it, don't they, here? Vinales has opened up on this lap again. 0.9 is the gap between himself. And it's proved to be a wise choice for them because he's upholding the Cationa in this opening race. The following month in May, but Magello may well be back racing by the end of May in Magello for the Italian. Shoulder injury, uh, not to be too harsh, but he's not quite at the calibre of the rest of the book. He didn't need replacing. Uh, he, he basically manufactured it so everybody was in place. If you could get that bike stopped and turned in, but now it's almost a disadvantage. He's not happy with the... He's there throughout this race. He's confident going into that tricky...